सो हेलो सो द देर इज अपडेट बेसिकली आई एम हियर टू टेल यू एन अपडेट फॉर द एंड्रॉयड थर्टीन एंड एब सो इफ एनी वन डेवलप अप्लीकेशन विच टारगेटिंग एंड्रॉयड थर्टीन एंड एब डिवाइज एंड यू आर गोइंग टू यूज पोस्ट नोटिफिकेशन देन मेक्स योर यू आस्क यूजर इज आइदर ही वॉन्ट्स नोटिफिकेशन ऑन नोट बेसिकली यू हैव टू आस्क परमिशन फ्रॉम द यूजर about this so i will use one signal login inside ini cordova and i will tell you how you can achieve this uh, this type of permissions uh, inside your uh, ini cordova so i will i will show you code and a and a demo uh, how the pop up will be uh, on the app when you uh, when you, when you will complete all the setup uh, about android 13 uh, पोस्ट नोटिफिकेशंस सो लेट्स चेक सो दिस इज द कोड फॉर वन सिग्नल सेटअप एंड बिफोर यूजिंग वन सिग्नल यू हैव टू रन दिस कमांड इन साइड योर प्रोजेक्ट आई ऑलरेडी हैव दिस प्लग इन इंस्टॉल्ड सो आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू इंस्टॉल दिस बट आई वॉन्ट टू टेल यू दिस इज द कमांड यू मस्ट इंस्टॉल सो आफ्टर इंस्टॉलिंग दिस this is the method of initialization of one signal plugin and you can see uh, we have method one signal in it and inside this uh, we at line number 5 to 6 we use one signal set app id window dot plugins dot one signal set app id so your app id will be available on one signal console you can get the app id when you create one signal uh, account on their uh, official uh, website so after uh, setting app id the most important thing inside this method is at line number 533 this is for regarding the prompt this is regarding the permissions which will uh, ask to the user so this is the uh, method window dot plugins dot one signal dot prompt for push notification with user response so uh, it basically uh, prompt user uh, to ask the ask the permission uh, either user want notification or not if user allow then you can able to send the push notification so this is the code uh, basically uh, for the setup and and more, and once also the important thing is inside config.xml file you must target sdk 33 if you are targeting android 13 and above so this is the most important thing inside config.xml file so this is whole is any cordova uh, cordova project so this is the this is the whole setup for the one signal and after when you successfully uh, install the plugin and uh, code setup is done and we run your application when the app loads uh, it will ask permission like this allow and don't allow this if user allow the permission push notification uh, will be allowed and you can able to send the notification so make sure uh, the one signal init method you will put inside app component dot ts file and uh, and you will uh, call inside device dot trd statement uh, so this is the way you can uh, do all those things thank you